original arcade version of OutRun was released by Sega in 1986. OutRun is a checkpoint based driving game where you set off with your girlfriend and you try to get to one of five distinct goals before you run out of time. Your final destination was determined by which branch you took at the end of your current stage. OutRun had 15 stages in total and in each individual game you drove through five before you reached your goal. Move forward 23 years and we come to the release of a sequel on Xbox Live Arcade, OutRun Online Arcade. And we find that aside from a graphical overhaul, a few tweaks and a few new game modes and the welcome addition of online multiplayer, not much has actually changed. OutRun is still a checkpoint based driving game where you travel across five stages with your girlfriend trying to reach one of five goals that are determined by the branches you take. Even the length of the stages are still roughly the same, with each stage taking about a minute to complete. And it is obvious that Sega follow the maxim that if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Outrun Online Arcade also borrows heavily from earlier Outrun sequels, and in many ways could be considered a condensed version of Outrun 2006, with the tracks being taken from the Outrun 2 SP arcade game. This means that in addition to the standard Outrun mode, there is also a time trial mode and heart attack mode. There is also a 15 stage continuous mode for both the outrun and time trial modes. Time trial mode is simply standard outrun without any additional traffic on the roads aside from two ghost cars which you can use to help determine how well you are doing. In order to add a bit more variation to this mode you are given a choice between using a standard or a tuned car. The difference with the tune car is that it's slightly faster but more difficult to control than your standard car. Heart attack mode gives you additional challenges to perform as you drive the course. These challenges include drifting, collecting coins and overtaking as many cars as possible. And there are other sorts of tasks you are given to do, which these tasks in the game are given to you by your girlfriend. You then get rated by a heart on how well you've performed each task. At the end of each stage at the checkpoint, you are given additional time depending on how well you have performed. The online multiplayer is, is simply a competitive form of the single player game for up to six players. While well, I found the races themselves ran smoothly and were highly enjoyable, I did have problems getting into pre-race lobbies, as I was frequently put into lobbies where the race had already begun. This meant I had to quit the lobby and search again until I eventually found one where the race had yet to start. Overall, I would say that Outrun Online Arcade is a limited game, but it is a faithful update of a classic game. What it does do, it does well. I think that the graphics are good for an arcade game, but on the other hand, I thought that the music was quite limited and some of the tracks sounded to me to be a bit timmy. I also found that the game was quite difficult as the time limits for each stage give you little margin for error, especially later on. This difficulty also translates into the achievements which in my opinion leads you to be a master of the game to get full points. We also feel that the game has a limited lifespan but the multiplayer should increase its lifespan to some extent as long as people continue to play the game. The final thing to note is the price, which is 800 Microsoft points. This to me is the correct price for this sort of game, was 1200 or more would feel overpriced. Given this price point though, I am happy to recommend Outrun on Online Arcade to fans of the genre. Anyone else should give the, the trial a go first or try an earlier version to see if they like it. Taking all these facts into consideration, I decided to give Outrun Online Arcade, a rating of 7 out of 10.